can build that a you it can get crazy but look though i'm here to do this q a because there's been a lot of questions you know what i'm saying y'all been wondering i did just do a q a with leah in the advice video on her page but i'm also gonna answer some questions that y'all had personally from me so we finna get to it but all i'm gonna say is I'm about to tell the honest to death truth with every single last one of these questions. And if you guys want to know more, the y'all had to. I got gum in my mouth, but my face looks swollen. Anyways, if y'all want more to the story or more what happened, make sure I blow this up. Like, y'all gonna have to really blow this up, or I'm not telling y'all shit. I'm just playing. But, period. Okay, so. Oh, let's start. With the first question the first question is how old are you baby i am 19 years old i am 19 years old 19 but grown never young but yeah i'm 19 i don't turn 20 until um august 30th next question how old are you baby i am 28 years old i'm 28 on last monday last monday i stopped being a part of c4s officially somebody else asked me how to join c4s i don't know i was there from the beginning from when we when i made let me see her and then it took off it to be a big group but i asked them shit i don't know i don't know Oh no. But then the next question is how did I meet Unique? Um, whenever I made the Let Me See a Challenge, I ended up meeting Prince at this content spot. It was him and her and they were going to I think a little dirt concert, something like that. So I said hey to her. Uh that stuff I didn't know her like that yet. And then she actually hit me up to do the on the flow video way back in August before it blew up. And that was how I met her. That's pretty much it. Sums it up. Um, how tall are you? I'm five eight. But let me tell you something. When people see me, I feel like a lot of people be expecting me to be like five three or something. Like people see me be like, "Dang, you big." I used to hoop it up, but I'm not big. Like what? I hate when people say that. Like it made me feel like, damn, like shit. I don't know. Next question is: Are you single or are you taken? Let's get into this question. Let's get into it. Cause wait a minute. Y'all. <laughs> Y'all. Okay, so <laughs> I don't even know how to Okay. I'm single, but I'm taken. But I'm single, but I'm taken. But I'm not dating him, but I'm fucking with him. That's my nigga, but that's not my nigga. Okay, I guess to answer your question, I don't know. Can I say, can I be the or in the question? Can I be just the or, not the single and take can I just be the or? Cause baby, I don't know. At this point, I'm finna just, never mind. I ain't even gonna say that. I ain't even gonna say that. But another question is, how did I become famous? I don't consider myself famous yet. I just well known um like i said i did the let me see a video actually go back though i hit 30k by myself well i all by myself but i'm saying like before i was with c4s i was at like 30 40k and that was because i had did this one video that hit 1.3 mil it wasn't a dance video it was like a little comedian video and then i made let me see you that challenge grew up i started going up from there and then the big boogie baby i'm a scorpio i'm rich you know let me tell my, I was hitting that. I got meals back to back doing that dance. So then I just kept blowing up, blowing up, blowing up, blowing up. I started doing gay skits on the internet. That started blowing up. I'm all over the gay pages on Instagram. That just, shit, that's just, shit, that's just what I do. But I'm trying to get up there. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to hit a meal, baby, on all platforms. But yeah. Next question is, is Leon, is, hold on, 
Are me and Leah still in the group C4S? I pretty much already answered this. No, I'm not. And to clear it up, no, she's not either. Um, she might tell y'all her side of the story. She might not. We might do a story at time together. We might not. So we'll see. Um, did you and Leah both leave C4S? And are y'all still cool with anybody else from the group? Yes, we both left. For the second part of the question. Okay, speaking on my behalf. As in cool with anybody from the group. I never had a problem. I Well, we've had issues in the past. But it was with the situation that made me leave. I never had a problem with them. I didn't even know they had a problem with me. So it's like. Now I'm not cool with them. Because they bashed me on Instagram. And posting TikToks. And all that other stuff. When half of them didn't even have nothing to do with the situation. But now I'm not cool with them. But yeah. I don't really mess with none of them. Ain't no really. I do not mess with none of them. Some of them I don't generally have a problem with. I'm just not anybody with the name attached. I'm not rocking with it. That's just that. That's, cause that's just how, how, how disrespectful the situation was to me when I had nothing to do with it. But like I said, if y'all want to know that story time and not a situation, blow this up. Because, yeah, I'm going to get keep it real. Um, Advice for growing influencers. My biggest advice is just to keep doing you and be consistent. It's really nothing more to it. You don't gotta, oh, I don't know how to TikTok. You don't gotta know how. You you find a way to do it for you. Find what's best for you. Find your algorithm. Algorithm, y'all know what I'm trying to say. Find your groove. Find what you do best. It's gonna come. I I wasn't just famous off the rip. Even though I wasn't taking it serious, like it just comes. It just comes. And also list um paying attention. Not studying, but like kind of studying what others do. It's so like they're trying to match the trends and set a new ones and stuff like that. Um, how did you get your apartments? I'm looking for some right now, but can't find the right one to move into. I don't want to be in the hood. Okay. First, don't be in the hood. <laughs> don't be in the hood. Don't you? You already know what the hood is. If you're staying in Dallas or if you are in Texas, you know which ones are the hood. But if you don't, you're trying to just move somewhere. Um, look it up. Look at the reviews. Look at I look a lot on TikTok. So like just trying to find apartments and shit. But it's like, and then you'll know because once you're comfortable in the apartments, and make sure you watch how the office staff treats you when you first get in there. Forget if it's the hood or not. You want to be somewhere comfortable and make sure they're gonna take care of you. So you know if you have a problem or anything has a uh problem like in your apartment you know it's gonna be taken care of care of but yeah just research 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 uh budget you need to know how much you making know how much the bills is make sure you making enough make sure your shit straight make sure all them other bills lining up that's just how you do it though that's just how you do it period but um somebody also asked me where did i get this wig from everybody been asking me Y'all ain't gonna lie. If y'all try to look up this wig, you're not gonna pretty much find it in this style because I cut it like this in the little heart shape because it's hot outside and it's cute. But it's from Gita Hair Company. G-E-E-T-A Hair on Instagram on all platforms, really. Sorry, my head itching. But it was originally like this long. And I trip, trip, trip. Still, it still be down there, but, you know, you cut it, the more it's gonna shrivel up. Yeah, the chill go. Yeah. Um, see if I have an, another question. What's going on with you and C Flowers? You're not fucking with them no more. It's not that I wasn't fucking with them no more, y'all. I didn't do anything. Like, not shit at all. But the situation that was brought to me had my name in it and because of a situation with a person that motherfuckers wasn't rocking with, try to take it out on me instead of coming for who they ain't come for. Or evaluated, but it's like they were so so quick to jump on me about any situation. Nigga, I could drop a grape and the motherfuckers gonna jump. Like it was shit like that. So I was gonna try to fix the shit, but I, after a while, I wasn't finna explain myself to no fucking body. What the fuck I'm finna explain myself to a person where every time something go wrong, you wanna be quick to jump instead of trying to see what's what's really happening. Like with my sisters, if we really gang, we really family, I'm not finna just up and oh I'm not fucking with her no more. 
Nah, bitch, if we really walking and we really like that, sorry, excuse my language, language. But if we really walking like that, I'm a call, nigga. What's up with you? Like, what's going on here? I'm not finna, oh, he say, she say, Ting said. I'm not finna do none of that, man. I'm too wrong. So now, nah, I don't rock with it no more. Cause I done got bash, lied on. All that, all that rah rah. So no, I'm not. But I still wish them nothing but the best and success. I niggas done call me Hollywood. I ain't did shit. I wouldn't even hanging out with the motherfuckers like that anymore because shit, they never, we wasn't clicking. Clout, who do I get clout from? We, if we was running it up together, so just shit like that. But y'all, another advice. If you were going to do something with a group, you need to make sure the motherfuckers is rocking with you for real. No kids up. And that's just the biggest thing because my motherfuckers not who, who you think you are, they are. Like, it's not. You're going to see that a lot in this motherfucking industry. And I'm not even talking about them or talking about them at all. I'm just talking in general, like. Motherfuckers is shy, and grainy, envious, and jealous. Like, all that. You gonna start to tell, though. It's gonna take a minute, though. It's, but it's gonna get the clicking, Steven. It's gonna get the clicking. I promise you. But that's pretty much all the questions that y'all have asked me. Very short, very simple. Like I said, it was a quick little Q&A, quick little video. But if y'all do want a story time or y'all want to ask more about the situation, I'm gonna drop another Q&A. Part two with the story time so i'm answering y'all questions first and then elaborate on the story but i just gotta blow this video up like comment share subscribe and all that stuff tinker gang